The Houston Astros taking action, firing Assistant General Manager Brandon Tubman after some controversial comments he made. This evening, the Astros General Manager Jeff Luno talked about the decision. Channel 2's Jonathan Martinez joining us live from Minute Maid Park tonight with the latest. Jonathan? Yeah, Bill, and this story certainly made headlines the last couple of days, but tonight the Astros organization giving a much different response than compared to days past. That original um, reaction by the Astros was wrong, and we own it as an organization. Days after defending assistant GM Brandon Taubman in a statement, the Astros organization now announcing they've parted ways after firing him. Regardless of who wrote it, and who approved it. It was wrong. It was incorrect. It should never have been sent out. Taubman came under fire for inappropriate comments made during celebrations in the clubhouse following the ALCS win over the weekend. We responded quickly thinking that it was not true and um, it turned out that that was incorrect way to go about it. The story first published by Sports Illustrated claiming Taubman not only made the inappropriate comments but also directed them to a group of female reporters yelling a half a dozen times, thank God we got Osuna. I'm so expletive glad we got Osuna. His comments tied to the team's signing of closer Roberto Osuna, controversial because last season, while playing for the Toronto Blue Jays and before being traded to the Astros, Osuna faced allegations of domestic violence. What we do know is the truth is that those comments were inappropriate. Um, they were directed at individuals, and that's inappropriate, and, and we weren't going to tolerate that. Initially, the Astros denied the exchange played out as portrayed in the article, but by Thursday afternoon, the team did an about-face following several interviews and looking further into the matter, one that ultimately led to Taubman's termination. His behavior was inappropriate and not representative of who the Astros are and our culture and what we stand for. And tonight, that general manager was asked if he has personally reached out to the reporter with Sports Illustrated associated with this story. He says so far he hasn't, but he was planning to. We're reporting live tonight from downtown. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Jonathan.